I'm Bridget. I'm Michael. And this is the BM Show. And today we're eating uh, chocolate tacos. They got discontinued, so um, say peace out to the chocolate taco. Hopefully, like some company comes by and like soups up the, the rights to it or something like Twinkies. Oh, is that what I want the Twinkies? Yeah, I think they closed this one out of business, and then somebody else got the rights to them or something. I don't really know. Oh, really? We're also going to be doing a, we're also going to be doing an interview. So I have some questions for Bridget, and you have questions for me, right? Yeah, our, I'm thinking of them right now. All right, sweet. Um, so this is something I have never had a choco taco before in my life. I know of them. I'm a fan of them, but mostly just because they're silly, and, and but I've never actually tasted one. Yeah, I haven't had one for a couple of years, but it's a it's dessert. It's a dessert taco. It's genius. It is genius. I used to like these at the pool. It was like if you got like ice cream cones, you run the run the risk of it like falling off. But this you got it right in your Same hand. Part. It's tight. Um, not super healthy. It's got 250 calories and like whatever. But like, it's because you, you're fructose. Yeah, it's got some uh, not so great uh, stuff in there. But like everything in moderation, right? Yeah. Just like eat one or two. Don't eat like a mad amount of it. Even though I totally I bought a total of six. <laughs> There's four left. All right, so you want to go ahead and open them? Yeah. All right. And uh, they're going away apparently, so like there'll be a link in the description to check out the article that they got discontinued. Mine is a little melty. Yeah, it's, it's whatever. Just a little. They were in a freezer. Okay. Yeah, mine's kind of melty too. <laughs> All right. So mine's kind of smashed, but um, ready? It was really, really melty. Check mine out. Cheers. All right, cheers. <laughs> All right, uh, I'll let you, I'll let you take the first bite of it, and let me like think of it then. It's awesome. It's pretty tight. I haven't had one for a while, but they're pretty good. I love this. It's kind of cool. I don't got brain freeze just yet, but. I got a little bit extra cold on my teeth. Oh yeah, same. I love them. Yeah, they're pretty tight. We gotta eat it too fast because it's melting. <laughs> yeah, it's melting and like this one's like, even though I had it in like a freezer bag with ice cubes in it all day, it still melted. It was in a freezer too, so. Mm -hmm. A not so great freezer, I guess, but. Uh -huh. All right, I'll leave that there. All right, I'm gonna start doing this interview, even if you're eating, mm -hmm. we tight. Okay. So I'm gonna ask the first question. A lot of these answers I already know, but we, the fans don't know. So, well, some of the fans might know, but we never know. Mm -hmm. um, first question up. What's your favorite Pokemon? Chansey. Yeah, Chansey. Chansey's the best mm -hmm. Pokemon ever. So like six years ago, I told somebody, I'm like, oh yeah, Chansey's my favorite. And then Bridget walks up, she's like, hey, I heard Chansey's their favorite. I'm like, yeah, and she's like, so, so is mine. I'm like, tight. And we've been friends ever since. Yeah, Chansey's mine too, so that's like, um, what's your first question? Wait, I when I say that, when, when I heard that Chansey was your favorite Pokemon, I was shocked. I was yeah, like, what? Why? Yeah, like, you're like, nobody likes Chansey. They don't make Chansey anything. Chansey, it, people just don't like Chansey, I guess. Also, like, I didn't know that you liked cute things. Yeah, so, I mean, Chansey's cute. He's tight. I'm down He is cute. Um, okay, so my first question was, when you were, okay, so think back when you were in the third grade. Okay. All right. Um, when you went to recess. Okay. Where did you hang out? Would I hang out like just like in the part in the playground? Like yes, I really do much. Yeah, but what did you do? Oh, and the, well, I didn't do this in third grade, but I'll just go up to different grades. So we had this one kid named Matt. Mhm. Mm like we used to play like he used to like Mad Max. So we played like we made up our own like Mad Max stories, and we're just like running around the playground, be like, hey, we're driving around in all beat up trucks. Oh, that's awesome. And like attacking stuff and like dealing with weird shit. I don't remember what it was called. I think, I think we called it Road Warriors. That but it was like, so but it was basically fun. like, it was like, I hadn't seen Mad Max at that point, so like, I didn't know what he was talking about. Mm -hmm. But I'm like, oh yeah, cool, it's, it's tight. And then I saw, I saw the Road Warrior eventually, and I'm like, okay, that's, that's where I got the name from. Did you know what it, like, were you picturing like Road Warrior? Kind of, because I think like he kind of described you like, hey, the trucks are all beat up, and it's like in the desert, and I'm like, okay. All right, that sounds. It like wasn't Fury really, time. but it was like different. Um, all right, next up, <laughs> what's your favorite Star Trek captain, or who I should say? Um. Oh, no. Uh, Picard. Picard, all right. Picard was mine for a long time. 
And then when the lockdowns happened, I started watching all Deep Space Nine. Mm -hmm. Like I had seen a couple episodes here and there, and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna watch this entire series because everybody says it's lit. Mm -hmm. And now my favorite is Cisco. Cisco's tight. He, he's a cute ball too. He's picked up. Well, he gets he shaved his head like halfway through the season, and then it becomes awesome. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, I like Picard because he. First of all, if I was going to serve under somebody, I feel like I could trust Picard. I suppose. Yeah, Cisco will do stuff like, he, he does one episode where he basically, like, stages a war with the Romulans to get, like, or stages a war. They, like, assassinate a Romulan, spoiler, sorry. Mm -hmm. They assassinate this Romulan dude and, like, to basically, like, get the Romulans to, like, be like, hey, the Dominion killed this senator even though it wasn't them that did it. Mm -hmm. So he wants to bring the Romulans into the war to help them out. Okay. And they're like, hey, the Dominion totally killed your senator. You should, like, join this war on our they side. They lied? Yeah. What the fuck? It was lit, dude. It was tight. Why? <laughs> Why did they do that? The, the, so the Dominion didn't spread all around the Alpha Quadrant and take everything over. So it was, like, for the greater good or whatever? Yeah. See, but then I don't like that shit from a, a Starfleet captain. I want them to be a rule follower most of the time. Well, I mean, that, 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 that's what's lit. That episode is tight because he's, like... He, he's like narrating the entire captain's log into mm -hmm. this, this computer and he's like can I live with myself for doing this I think I can I think I can I think like I can like live with it and then yeah. at the end he like takes a sip of like of like a wine like I think it's like whiskey or something mm -hmm. and then he's like computer delete that entire record so yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's 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 tight what all right, all right we're okay. back we had to throw the wrappers away you were like you're getting it was all melty it was sticky all right oh yeah it was your question okay so my question is um on your own body, what is your favorite body part? Probably my arms. They're tight. Yeah, yeah. they're fucking tight. Dude, they're you're strongest. <laughs> you see. What about your? Michael. What about you? Michael's the strongest man alive. Um, probably my hands. Right, I feel. I like my hands. Yeah, they're I cool. need them all the time. Yeah. I'm like, God damn, you it's guys like are good It's like in Game of Thrones stuff. when the guy's like, Hey, like, I'm gonna cut your either your hands or your tongue off. What do you want me to cut out? And he's like, well, I need, uh, like, I need my hands to play my instruments. And you're like, all right, it's going to be your tongue then. And the funny thing is, I've never seen a full episode of Game of Thrones. Everybody's just like, how do you know the stuff that happens in Game of Thrones? I'm like, because I know what's up. Dude, I just heard about that about you. Yeah, I didn't I, know that, but I heard about that you, about you yesterday. I was like, what? This whole time? All right, cool. Ready for the next one? Yes. All right, what's your favorite uh, snack at movie theaters? Okay, um, nachos. Nachos? I'm down. What do you think about, what do you think about popcorn? I like popcorn. What do you think about popcorn with nu nutritional yeast? That was, remember when we went to like a yeah. big adventure and the guy's like, hey, you should try this yeast on your popcorn and we're like, what the hell? And I'm like, Isn't okay. weird? And also, what is nutritional yeast versus just yeast? I don't know. I don't really use yeast because I don't make anything. But it I was like... I nobody use yeast. I didn't eat a lot of the popcorn. So what did you, what did you think of the yeast popcorn? It was okay. They, they were like, oh, it tastes like cheese, but it didn't. They were like raving about it, and they're like, oh my god, it's awesome. I'm like, I, I don't thought really... it was mediocre. Yeah, mediocre. I think mediocre. They... Uh, my favorite is, um, I used to like licorice a lot, like Twizzlers. Mm -hmm. Like when I was a kid, I would always get Twizzlers, and then like when I was like, pull and peel or regular. I don't think pull and peel was like existed when I. Oh yeah, yeah no, that shit is recent, isn't it? It's not that recent. It's like maybe like 1994 or something. Oh, okay. But this is like 1980s. Okay. Like, like late 80s, but um. Then I started liking milk does. Milk does were cool. They're it, too sticky on my teeth. Yeah, they're bad for your teeth. So like, I stopped eating that. And I don't usually get snacks and pop at theaters anymore. But when I went to LA the last time, I went to see Evil Dead 2 in the theater at Tarantino's. And they had dots. And I'm like, okay, I'll buy some dots. I haven't had dots in years. And it was, they were tight. I feel like dots, dots in my head, or I don't think I've ever eaten dots except for the small container from home. Like, like Halloween, yeah, this is like a regular size, like not a, few, a huge box, but like a regular box. Like, I don't even know where you can buy that shit. The regular ones? Yeah. I don't know, maybe like Walmart, maybe? Maybe. I don't really know. Anyway. Oh okay. yeah, your, your question. Um, oh shit, my question. Okay, um, um, oh no, um, all I can think of is Star Trek questions. Okay. I was gonna do it live, but then all I can think of is Star Trek questions. Okay, yeah, you can ask Star Trek questions. It's fine. If you can't come up with any more questions, I have like, uh, let me see, one, two, three, four, five more questions? Five? One, two, three, four, yeah, five questions. I don't know, I don't know, I'm freezing, I'm freaking out now. All right, uh, we'll go to the next one. Okay. Um, if you have three albums that you're like, what are your like three albums that are like perfect? They're like, you're like, these albums are tight. 
There's music like only three. albums? Yeah, music albums, but you can't choose greatest hits because that's kind of like... That's oh, the, that's fuck! Here. That's what I was exactly was gonna do! <laughs> yeah, because it, it, feel, it feels like cheating kind of. It is like, cheating. It's completely it, cheating. Because you're like, I can just do the greatest hits of this band and be good. And they're like, nah. Okay, um... Three, oh, three of them. I can't even remember... Okay, so, uh... 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 A Night at the Opera by Queen. All right. I kind of think, I figured you were going to say that. <laughs> um, a... There's... I can't remember the name. What's, who's, who's it by? Devo. Oh, I don't know. It's the one with space junk on it. Okay. I don't really know. I'm not, I don't really follow Devo too much besides some of the, like, the stuff that I already like. It's kind of like everywhere. It's not... It might be Duty Now for the Future. I think that's what it is. All right, I have no idea. But I can't remember for sure. Um, and then my last favorite album is probably the White Album. I love the White Album. All right, I'm down. All right, mine are um, version 2.0 by Garbage. Okay. That album is tight. And then uh, Wasting Light by Foo Fighters. And then uh, what's it called? There's Nothing Left to Lose, the same band. Nice. You have those two CDs I gave them to you before. Yeah, they're those are my also favorite very, very good albums. All right, any, do you have any other thing? Or um, I think it's your question if you have one. It's okay. not, we can just cross this list. So if you had a, okay, so think like sci-fi tools. Okay. Okay. And that can include a suit or an exoskeleton. I'm saying that now. If you could pick like a sci-fi tool that you could have at home, what would you pick? Oh, I would just pick data because you can do everything. Data is not a tool. He's his own person. But he, he can be a tool sometimes. I feel like that I might, especially after that episode when they were like gonna shut him down because he's a, yeah they're like he yeah. was just an android yeah but he's but, not just an android that, that, he's that, a that whole episode person. is tight I'm he's just trolling I'm just trolling about this whole person I'm trying to think of what I would want can like a replicator be a tool yeah fuck yeah what about a holodeck well, a holodeck's not really a tool it's like a a holodeck doesn't seem like a tool it's one of these like that you like are like yeah that's with I don't know maybe like a hypo spray. Because, like, if you want to get, like, injections, you don't need to, like, stab yourself. You're just like... How many times do you need to get injections, though? Oh, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. How about, what about tricorders? Because tricorders could just read stuff and tell you, like... Just about, kidding. You I don't can know. choose whatever you want to choose. I don't know. Probably a replicator, because I'd just be like, yo, I want, yeah. some, I want some ice cream. And it's like... Did, yeah, replicator. Earl Grey tea hot. Yeah. Or coffee, if you're, if you're like, down with Jane Wayman. but Earl Grey tea is tight. Yeah. Um, I know you like Wes Anderson. Uh-huh. So what's your favorite movie? From him. The Life Aquatic with Steve right. Caesar. I think mine's uh, Moonrise Kingdom. Uh, really? I think so. I don't That's know. Nice. I like how like the Boy Scouts are all like military. They're like and they're like they're like you're falling out of line. You're a wall. You're doing all this. And, like, and then <laughs> but then that dog got shot. Oh, I forgot about the dog. Yeah, you're <laughs> yeah, like oh, right. it got, it got hit with an arrow. All right, what's up? Your your question. Mm. Okay. Um. Within our solar system. What, like, pretend that you could just visit a planet within our solar system? Yeah. Which one would you choose? Uh, I don't know. Depends. We see. I don't know if there's any ones I would actually want to go to. They all seem not so great. Well, pretend, you, you can pretend well, like, you like can't go to you can't go to Venus because it's all gas. Unless you have, like, a suit. Mercury gets mad hot. Yeah. Unless it's at night. Well, I guess night is, rel night is relative because it's, like, depends on where, the, <laughs> where it's spun around. Um... I don't know. Maybe like Jupiter seems like it'll be tight, just because of the like, how, how violent the storms are. I'd be like, hey, I'm gonna like just like walk out of this violent storm to see how if I can handle it. That could be cool. Or Mars. As long as you don't crack your helmet open like Schwarzenegger did in that movie, a Total Recall. Yeah. And your eyes like bulge out of your head. <laughs> All right. Dude, Mars. What, what, oh, what planet were you going beautiful. to? Beautiful. Um, Neptune. Right. Because it looks pretty, from. The yeah, but, that I've seen. but you're looking at it from like a really far away. I wonder what like what it's like close up, right? Do you think it's still blue? Uh, probably, probably parts of it. Uh, probably like an atmosphere thing. Yeah. I don't know, or water. I don't know. All right, planet. All right, next one. Wh who's the coolest celebrity that you ever met? That's not from me. Ah! I'm, 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 I'm just trolling. Ah! Um. <laughs> I don't know when he's. I don't think I've ever met a celebrity before. Some celebrities are like, what about when uh, when you met Ariana Grande or whatever? 
Oh yeah, probably Ariana Grande because she's the only celebrity I ever met. I, I didn't but she was very nice. Like, oh, I didn't like talk to her. Stop. Like, or I spoke to her, but we weren't like friends. Yes, I, I got you. <laughs> uh, I guess mine is Shirley Man. Shirley Man. I met her at a book signing. Oh yeah. She's tight. Oh, she's and, there was, nice. and the whole band too was cool. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that was like five years ago or something. Oh yeah, you're up. Um. Okay. Uh. How 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 many hours total do you think you could walk? Like without stopping. Without stopping. What about the, what, like, what about to get water or something? Does that count? If well, I feel, like, if you have bottle? you have water. I like enough. Yes, as oh. much as you want and food. No, uh, I don't know. Probably like without stopping. Uh, and it doesn't it, matter how fast. How long it depends on also the terrain. If it's like straight, like if it's like city walking, uh -huh. probably like eight hours. I think. Maybe more, but if it's like if it's like in like hiking up a trail that goes uphill, you're gonna, it's gonna be less. Yeah. What about you? I was gonna say something like eight hours, but now that you said that, I'm like five hours. Okay, five hours. I'm gonna say five. I bet I could, without stopping. I bet I could. All right, cool. Well, oh, what about peeing? Well, I don't know. You, mm. just, you just gotta walk and walk and pee. Yeah, just I don't kiss know. Kiss yourself. Probably, I don't know. <laughs> well, if there's a thing that they say you, you don't have to, like the water You just it. happen to not have to pee. Yeah, I suppose. Five hours. All right, uh, next question up. What's your, some of your favorite Reddits? Do you use Reddit at all? I do. I have like, a bunch of favorite ones that are tight. What are yours? Okay, um, oh geez. What's that uh, one you told me about where the dog was like in the fence like this and it was like, this is my life? Oh. Yeah, yeah, this is my life. Oh, this is my life. I like, um, uh, What is it? Kids are fucking stupid. Yep. Oh, I was about to say the same one. Dude, that one is that one. so funny. Yeah, that one's tight. Like, it's kids doing really stupid stuff. Sometimes they get hurt, but like a lot of times it's like just stories of like, I posted something on there where like I took a raw egg one time when I was like four and put it into like a hard boiled egg slicer and I squeezed it and it just <laughs> broke the egg and like egg was like leaking all over the ground. My parents were like, what are you doing? I'm like, oh, I wanted these eggs. And they're like, you gotta put a, you can't put a raw egg in egg. Yeah. Here. That's exactly it. All right, Just so like, Jesus when you say kids, kids are stupid, what's the other one? Um, how about uh, our sewing? Sewing, like sewing. Okay. Um, I'm not into sewing, but uh, 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 hold, hold up. What's like, that? Hold up. H O L U P. Hold up. What's it about? Like where something's going on and then something like maybe you didn't expect you're like hold up what is that okay I like a, kind of a double take sort of thing yeah. I guess um and then um what's the one self aware wolves okay that one's funny um it's like people one. almost it's like people making arguments about shit but like it's like they're like like, like wolves like like actual animals like they're it's like the people who are people are almost get it. I don't know how to describe it. I don't know. Self-aware wolves. Yeah. That's what it's called. Yeah. Okay. So. And then, all right. That was it. That was all right. I have to think of my, um, some of mine. Busy. You, you took one of the ones I was gonna say about the kids being stupid. Okay. That was that was tight. I like it's that one. so funny. Um. Let's see. There's um ones I like. I go to like a lot are like where there's kids are stupid. There's the um. I do like the, uh, the Star Trek ones, like Star Trek memes or just Star Trek in general. See, uh, yeah, I don't follow any of them. The Star Trek memes, like, Star Trek memes is, is cool because it's just memes about Star Trek. Oh, Hydro Homies represent, hi, shout out to the Hydro Homies. I don't know. About it's a, me, a subreddit all about drinking water. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So, like, there's people that are like, check out my new water bottle, it's awesome. And then there's people that they always, like, talk smack on Nestle because Nestle's bad. They were like, like, Nestle's terrible, like, look at this bottle, like. And they're just all about drinking water and that's it? Yeah, like, memes about drinking water or See, just, I like, jokes about drinking water. And, like. <laughs> That's so weird. Yeah, I like, love that. Yeah, it's tight. Like, one time I took a picture, picture of a magic card and it had a, a dry fish on it. It was like, <laughs> like a skeleton, and the, the text on the bottom was like, when water is lacking, everything suffers. I posted that, it on there and got a mad amount of upvotes. Yeah, that's So there's the Hydro, Hydro, Hydro Homies, um, the Star Trek subreddits, the kids are stupid, like she said. Yeah. Or kids are effing stupid. Yeah, yeah. That one's, that one's awesome. I love that one. Um, I, I, I had a couple other ones that I really go to a lot. I can't check my phone because my phone's over there. Yeah. Uh, subreddits that were great. Let me see if those ones are tight. Um, 
I guess like, yeah, Star Trek ones, there's some Star Wars ones, I like some Marvel movie, some of the MCU ones, or mm -hmm. Marvel Studios, I guess. Mm -hmm. uh, some, like I said, the, the Star Trek stuff. I usually do like video game collecting ones sometimes. Oh, like okay. Old, like old video games. Oh, yeah, yeah. You have a super collection. I haven't been, I haven't like bought anything new for a while, so I've really been like in that one like super often. Mm -hmm. I guess there's also the Foo Fighters subreddit, which is also t is also tied. Oh yeah, subreddit. dude, that one is like gives you all kinds of cool stuff though. Yeah. Like yeah, the, the, I feel like that one helped you find out all this, or you're always mentioning it about like. Yeah, there's like all these like cool videos on there with the band and like other like interviews and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, another like really cool, like I said, like I said, yes, I guess Hydro Homies, Star Trek, the Foo Fighters one. And like all the like kind of like nerdy like movie ones. Word. All right, what's your next question, Clay? Oh crap. Um, if you had like unlimited funds, oh, this is basically the planet question. I feel like it's not good to do that again. What's what's your favorite sea creature? Sea creature? I don't know. What's that thing that looks like Chansey but it's not Chansey? Axolotl. Yeah, that's it. That thing. <laughs> like... Yeah. Let's get those weird. What's yours? Same? Or um, mine right now is probably a decorator crab. Decorator crab? Yeah, or I like a decorator crab. Like, it, like it actually decorates stuff? It decorates itself. Is it like it blinks itself out? It's also yeah. So it'll like grab things and like stick it on it, and it decorates its own self. But does it does it decorate? Is it, is it like a does it like wonder be like does this clash with my shell? Is it like not look good? Yeah, they always look so pretty. Yeah, but do they ever put something on and they're like, nah, this is not good. I don't know. Or do, do they ever see a lot of decorator crab that has the same thing and they're like, I'm like, oh bitch, I want that. Thing. Or or you, it. or you stole that they're from like, me. Give me that. Or be like, hey, I'm like, like what do they put? What do they put? Wait, what do they what do they put on it? Like all kinds of things. Um. So like I wonder if there's one of them that like sees another crab wearing the same thing that it was been wearing for a while and be uh -huh. like, be like I'm the one that started that trend. What are yeah. you doing? Or just like so upset that like oh my god I went out and she was wearing the same dress as me. Yeah. Um, they, I think that they choose it by what it looks like. I think. Right. Because cool. I I don't know. I might be making this up. I might just be making this up. So I really don't know. But I think that they choose things. Um, right. by what they look right. like. All right, we're back. The phone went off, so we have to answer it. Hi. Uh, we were talking about decorator crabs, but I think we're, we're, we're pretty much done talking about them, right? Yep. Decorator crabs, don't hate decorate. All right. <laughs> oh my god, I've never heard that, but I love that. You've never heard Okay. Uh, for reals? <laughs> huh? I used to have this thing where I used to work at this restaurant, and it was always like, don't hate, and then it was like, I had like a million different things. <laughs> okay. I was like, scrap everything out. I want to hear as many as you can think of. Go. It was like, don't hate decorate. We just did that one. Like, don't hate procrastinate, which doesn't make sense. Good procrastinate. <laughs> There's like, don't hate like, um, don't like hate. mediate. Like be like, hey, like people are fighting. You gotta mediate. You gotta yeah, mediate. yeah. There's like, don't hate mediate. Don't hate. Um, some of these like I can't say for the show because like they're they're pretty inappropriate. So I'm, I like, I'm really not gonna say want to hear them so much. I'll, I'll tell you once we're done. For, for okay, okay. Days. We don't want to get like banned off YouTube or anything. Any more? No, we're not paying off. Of, I, I don't tell, hate deteriorate. Yeah, that works. Or don't hate like uh, don't hate decimate. <laughs> um, don't hate recreate. Yeah. Don't hate skate. I don't know that doesn't make sense. <laughs> All right, so one last question. Uh, this is the final question. Or like, yeah, oh yeah, so you asked about the secret creature. I have. You yes, might, yes. Uh, what's the craziest costume you've ever made? Craziest. Aside from the one that was tight, yeah, she made me a chancy costume. It was lit. <laughs> it had a huge egg, and the egg was like this big. It was so soft, that egg. Yeah, I still have it. It was so squashy and nice. That's not the whole costume. You should wear it. Oh, I'll have to bring it over at some time. Put it in a bag or something. <laughs> um. But you were, yeah, so like the best, like, at least team costume was Nurse Joy and Chansey. Well, obviously. Because we had to like delay that, that for really a year good. because I'm like, oh yeah, I can't go to the Comic Con this year because oh, I'm yeah, going to be out of state. Oh, garbage concert. No, it wasn't a garbage concert. It was some other convention I went to or something. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Um. But we went to that, and then like what we did in 2018, Chancey and Nurse Joy, did everybody came up to us and they're like, you're like, Chancey's right over there, and I was just like, Chancey! <laughs> um, Alright, so craziest costume you okay. ever made for yourself. So I, one time I dressed up as the penguin from, um, yeah, from the, uh, uh, what, what's that guy's name, Tim Burton? Though? Yeah. Danny yeah, DeVito. Mm-hmm. And I, I had a, my, my handbag 
because it's you always have to have a handbag if you're gonna wear a costume to Comic Con, especially. People always forget about a handbag, but then you're like, what do I do with my stuff? Where's my phone? Anyway, um, yeah, especially if you don't have pockets or anything. Yep. So I made a purse out of like a rubber fish, and like I gutted the fish and put yeah. um and put a zipper in it, and I also made a. Uh, an umbrella that was like vinyl and it had a swirl on it okay and then i um because then he grabbed the wrong one he's like i grabbed the cute one <laughs> or whatever it was he's got like he's got like a million different umbrellas that like <laughs> do different stuff and then i use this stuff to black my teeth so i just did it on the sides so all my teeth look like they were pointy so i painted each one of my teeth i got you and so people and people bought it, which is nuts. But it, I, it looked crazy. Do you so have like? Do you have like black crap on your, your Oh, face? I so I did. I put um. Great what, Kool Aid. What's that supposed to be? Like, is, it, you know, is it like fish blood or something? Or? I have no idea. Just black stuff. Yeah. I don't know what it was. It was fish blood or something like that. What's the? What's this penguin do to that guy? Doesn't he like bite a guy's nose off or something? In that movie. I don't remember. I haven't seen that in a long time. Yeah, that was probably be a while. since I wore the costume, which was a long time ago. Oh, I feel. But that was a really fun costume. All right. You know, wait, wait. I just want to make. It, I'm not gonna go into the whole thing, but another really great costume was when I dressed as Freddie Mercury at Comic Con in 2019. Yeah. And Michael put me on his shoulders so I could recreate the photo. Uh, where um, Freddie Mercury was riding on Darth Vader's shoulders. Yeah, it was lit. Um, Cause Freddie Mercury would do that sometimes. He'd just like enter a show on the shoulders of Darth Vader. And I really wanted to do that. And we had a Darth Vader helmet and Michael was like, I'll do that. And I was like, are you serious? And he was like, yes. <laughs> and I got a stub ladder and he let me ride on his shoulders as Freddie Mercury while he was being Darth Vader, and it was the shit. It was the best. It was awesome. <laughs> All right, the final. Oh, no, so that was Wait, the part. What was yours? Mine what was, was yours? um. So you see, most craziest costume. You, you kind of probably already know what it is, but um. So remember the Star Trek episode where Tasha Yar gets killed? Yes. It was that. By this black sludge. Yeah, it was literally a trash bag that I cut holes in, <laughs> and I put like cut eye holes in it, and put uh, like armholes. I wore like a black T-shirt and like black shorts, and I was just like. Jeez. Whoa! Sorry, I was like, I'm the black. Uh, I think his name is Armus. Is the creature's name Armus? Yeah, but he looks like a. He looks like basically like, like a big pile of like sludge. Slime. Yeah, black yeah. Sludge. <laughs> oh my god! So that, that, is that was it. A clever costume. Yeah, it, it was tight. It was awesome. I, I entered into a costume contest. I didn't win, of course. I didn't expect to win because that's literally, bullshit. But it's literally just a black trash bag. But it's so clever. It's clever, but I mean, it wasn't like super like intricate. So I didn't win the costume. Yeah, but, like, but still, I mean, like, I feel like there's work. But then there's just like, like it's, that's so fun and funny. Yeah, it's awesome. That's a great costume. All right, that was my final question. Do you have any, any other questions? Um, who's the best Pokemon ever? Chansey, of course. <laughs> you know who the worst Pokemon ever is? Who? Audemo. I'm just kidding. I knew who it was. <laughs> yeah, Audemo is terrible. We, we don't like Audemo. Mm -mm. But Audemo's favorite Atlantis Morissette set song is probably You Audemo. That makes me like Odno a little bit better. Well, I mean, it's all right. It's all right. <laughs> I mean, but yeah, but Odno is uh, incompetent. Like, it locked itself in a closet one time with Pokemon, and then, like, they're like, we can't treat these Pokemon as a closet. It's locked Odno, and Odno's like, I don't know. Jesus. Or I don't know what it's like. Get your life together, Odno. Um, suck uh, at being a nurse. <laughs> yeah. All right, that's going to do it for this interview. This interview and this ice cream tasting mm -hmm. with the Taco Tacos. All right. I have more Taco Tacos at home if you want any more of them. They're in the freezer. They got like four left. Can we start doing like a sign off thing? Yeah, what do you want to do for a sign off thing? I don't know. I thought it was smash that subscribe button or whatever you like to say. Smash that subscribe button. Yeah, click the notification oh, bell. Oh yeah, and we could go be seeing you. Yeah, be seeing you, players. <laughs>